Good morning. I'm at Starbucks. I publicly support being jealous of uh, governor of the state of Maryland. I can't do the live fees. My service ain't working. I'm publicly supporting being jealous over Governor Hogan. Hogan only coming in the community giving you book bags, but he ain't giving you heat in your schools. He ain't giving you air conditioning. He ain't giving you the proper tools for your education. You feel me? He got us kids in photo ops, but he ain't got our kids' best, best interests in hand. I'm at Starbucks, all right? I'm voting for Ben Jealous, and I'm a black Republican, all right? It's the Woody Lynch letters, make him a slave. We wanna break them, we gotta use this, and Hogan is using this now, all right? Right here it says, black slaves. I have a foolproof plan and method to controlling your for at least 300 years, all right? I know your game plan. I know how you got Kenny Ibram in your community in, zone, in that zone, you know what I'm saying? I know how you got certain people in the community that you putting money in their pockets. You feel me? I worked with Bob Ehrlich when you got Ehrlich elected, all right? My store on Falls Road was campaigning for Republicans. I was recruiting blacks to join the Republican Party. I was making a documentary about the corruption in the Democratic Party, but ain't no difference in the Republican Party. Ben Jealous is gonna clean up the corruption. Ben Jealous is gonna make change. He's just gonna use our kids for photo ops. He's gonna make a difference. You feel me? Now getting back to the Republican Party, I'm a black Republican. I help get uh, Bob Ehrlich elected. I campaigned for Bob Ehrlich. I did parties for Michael Steele at Bart Mitchell's house up there in Cockeysville. I'm well known in the Baltimore community. So what I'm telling you is the truth. All right? Governor Hogan is not for the black community. This is what it is. And you need to read the